YouTube, this is your girl Samantha Sweets, and welcome back to my channel, my channel. Hey, sweetie squad, what's up, my lovies? Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day, wink, wink. Okay, guys, so right now, and I have contemplated over and over again if doing this video is right, I don't know, but I know that my subconscious feels some type of way and I know that this is gonna keep bothering me unless I get it out there and as you guys know, I'm a venter. I don't keep things inside. That's unhealthy by the way, if you keep things inside and then just boom, blow up when you do. So I am here, I guess, to make a reaction of everything that happened yesterday, everything that transpired and trying to clear it up for the last and final time because after today I am not after this video I'm not gonna really worry about it no more I, I I've tried and people want to keep it going and I'm not gonna say what people but I'm just saying people so let's just remind everybody if you guys are new to the YouTube channel what's up I'm your girl Samantha Sweets please make sure you hit the subscription button below give it a click right here ring a ding 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 the bell turn your post notifications on why because I do giveaways on this channel and right now I have a Jeffree Star premium mystery a Valentine's Day box giveaway going on the rules are very simple all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel make sure you like on that video and make sure you comment down below of that video which is my favorite Jeffree Star lip okay guys let's get in to this video okay so yesterday as you know I was upset I was upset 2020 has not been good for your girl it really just hasn't and I things have transpired things have occurred and I just had enough and I blew up okay I was pissed off at subscribers and I was upset and I included in my video a certain YouTuber. Everybody knows now who that YouTuber is. But again, I'm not gonna say her name on camera. It's, it's, it's just, it's why, ew, no, I'm not gonna say her name. So pretty much you guys were all asking who's that YouTuber and I would not say the name. When you guys DM me and said, is it this person? I said, yes. I never cursed her out of her name. I never called her a name. I never said anything of that sort. I was upset and I reread our messages wrong. I did. And after people were sending me her tweets because she was tweeting last night like crazy, um, she had every right to be upset. She did. I did not fault her for that. However, Okay, and we'll say this, and again, I don't know if I'm making the situation worse or better or whatever, but everybody is like, um, after I, after I saw her tweet, I was like, well, damn, let me go back and reread these messages because here's the truth. And this is the funny part. Exactly, exactly 30 to 45 minutes after I posted that video, she inboxed me on Messenger and asked if I still wanted to do the collab with the Tati palette because I offered that. I was like, okay, someone told this girl about the video. Someone told her or she's seen the video or whatever, but I'm not that person to be like, nope, I'm good. I'm not that person. So I'm not a bitch. If that's the way you want to put it, I can be one, but I prefer, I, I prefer not to be. So I was like, okay, maybe she realized, you know, that I am upset and she wants to, you know, um, wrong her right or right her wrong. <laughs> there you go. Right her wrong. So I agreed. And then she told me she had bought this other palette and I said, oh no, I don't have that one yet. I heard it wasn't good. And then after she said she had gotten it, I was like, okay, well, you know what? I'll get it. So I went and ordered the palette last night. That was the last message I have gotten from her. Okay. I, after went on and publicly apologized, okay, and everybody was saying that I didn't have to do that, but you know what, I did it, I'm a real woman, and I admit when I'm wrong, people were still coming from her, for, for her, I guess. Now, she said that her name was in the comments, her name was not in the comments at all, I've gone back and reread those comments three times, and I did not see her name in the comments at all, because they were in the comments, I would have immediately took them down. I don't want people to fault this YouTuber for some mistake that I did. That is the most important thing of this video right here. Well, 
I, I saw my sweetie squad and I guess, you know, we have the same subscribers, which is great, which is fine. Most YouTubers do. When I saw the, mind you, I don't follow her on Twitter. So any venting she did was sent to me on Messenger. So everybody was sending me messages. Everybody was telling me everything. And I saw one of the tweets that said from my subscriber, and I guess hers, saying that she went live. She publicly apologized. It was just an honest mistake. It truly was. I reread the messages and it was. I saw and I even showed it to um, someone else. And I was like, look, do you see how I kind of got this confused? Because I was really stressed after the, I, I went to bed. Like I was done with last night. Everybody was still messaging me. Everybody was still commenting. Everybody was still just making this go on and on. And I don't hold grudges. That's something I don't do. Ew, I don't hold grudges. Wanna know why? I don't hold grudges because it's a waste of my time and energy. Don't hold grudges. Don't, don't do it. So, okay. You had my sweetie squad, I guess, like, you know, attacking her or, you know, basically telling her, you know, that's messed up, yada, yada, yada. And I had her people, because I seen it, and I damn sure confronted that person trying to come at me. Oh, I used to follow her. She just wants the attention, um, but she's clickbait, so I unfollowed her, and she talks about people. Girl, I'm going to make you swallow those words, honey. Do not try me, A, okay? So whoever you are, okay, because I tweeted you back, and I was like, okay, so um, what's really good? Here I am. Do you want to, do you want to say something to my face? Because first of all, I don't, I'm not clickbait. I hate those people that are clickbaits. Okay. Because that's lies. And it's something I don't do Two, I don't talk junk about people. Who do I talk junk about? Uh, the news, uh, people that are stupid and irrelevant. Like really, who are you? You don't know me. So to me, you're sort of irrelevant, honestly. And your message really, I mean, hell, it didn't bother me none, honestly. What bothers me the most is the person, the YouTuber. And again, I won't say her name on camera, but she had no problem. And this is the only thing in the whole mix that I was upset about. She screenshotted and posted our personal messages. That is my social media information. That's my messenger. So, and I don't care that subscribers want to follow me or message me. I have a lot of you guys that follow me on DM and Messenger. That is great. But let's just say I did not want. Now they have it. That to me is kind of... Mm, it wasn't needed, if that's the word. Like, I have a bigger word, but I'm not going to use it. But that just wasn't needed. So, again, I apologize. And for people that did not see the live and they're still just watching that video and they're still talking about, oh my God, who's that YouTuber? Oh my God. Guys, let's, for the 20th time, she didn't do nothing wrong, okay? I made a mistake. I jumped ahead of the gun. That is me part of being Latina. I am a quick fireball. I, real quick, okay? I was already upset by what I called the roaches. And I'm not gonna take that back. Because it's the, 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 the subscribers and I know who they are and they only watch me when a giveaway is irrelevant. Other than that, they don't care. A sweet squad don't exist to them. Only when the giveaway is there. And I see a lot of you guys are like, Sam, I don't care about your giveaways. I don't, I know. I know you guys don't, honestly. I know who I'm talking about and they know who I'm talking about too. So, and I was upset at the two other incidences. So then you had one of her people, because I know she ain't my people, go on my comments and say, well, don't you think you should take the video down because it's still um, disgracing the YouTuber or whatever she said, I don't know. And my answer is, nope. That's my answer, no. I'm not taking the video down because I had already corrected my mistake on two different occasions. This is the third. I went live. I put it in the top of the comments and now I'm making another video. I am done with the situation. I have other things to do. I have PR to get to. I have other things to do. So everyone's asking me, oh, are y'all still gonna do the collab? Are you guys going to? That is totally up to her. That is totally up to the YouTuber. I have apologized. 
I apologized on Messenger. She has not responded. She has not looked at it. I'm probably blocked. I don't know. Well, I'm not blocked because I was blocked. It would say this person blocked you, but it's probably like ignored. I'm not stupid. I know this thing. So I sent her two sorry gifs and I also um, sent her a lengthy apology. So that's all I'm going to do. I'm not reaching out no more. People, um, I don't want to say grieve because that's the bad word. That's not the word I'm looking for. Um, people heal and get over their own issues on their own time. And that's something as an adult I'm still realizing because I get so annoyed when people like, are like, okay, this happened five minutes ago. Are we over it now? That's who I am. I'm someone that don't hold grudges. And other people might. I'm not saying she does. But I'm just saying maybe she has to really, you know, like, get everything in. She has to gather everything in. She's supposed to make a reaction video today. I got that tweet too. So I don't know what her video is going to say. I, I honestly don't know. I care. I do. But again, I can't let something like this um, degrade my channel or um, I honestly want to add come between a friendship because I do look at this girl as a friend. And like I said, that's why I was hurt because I felt kind of like I felt lied to and I felt pushed to the side. And I've already been going through issues like that with friends recently. So it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a trigger for me. And that's why I lash so quickly because I, you know, people that I've, you know, I'm, I'm there for, I feel have been stabbing me in the back recently. So, um, but again, that is here nor there. And, um, that's just something we have to learn about. And another thing, this is important. And again, we all have our own ways of coming to terms with things. And we all have our own ways of handling situations. Um, when a subscriber says junk about me or YouTuber or whatever, a person, when a person does, I'm not going to let it take a toll on me. I'm not. However, because I gave a certain person anxiety last night and because I suffer from anxiety I honestly do that is why I decided to end the night and I was gonna jump back on their live trust me I was but I feel like I started drinking so my mouth would have been again reckless have no filter and I might have said things that I don't that I regretted and I just didn't want to do that so I am growing as a person and then some people say oh you're a professional you don't need to let people into your life, into your into your business. Someone told me that yesterday. And I, I have to correct that. I feel you guys are my friends, my family. So I'm letting into, into my world. I'm letting you guys into my life because I'm letting you see that we go through the same things. We go through the same stress. We go through the same angst. And as I put out there for anybody, and a lot of y'all were, when that situation occurred, I put it out there, not for views, not for money, not for attention. I put it out there because other people have probably gone through the same situation as I've gone through. And now you have information, you have ways of dealing with it. You know, you're not alone in the world. Like there you go in a nutshell. So again, if she wants to do the collab, I'm here for it. It'll probably be later on down the road, you know what I mean? Um, this is a process of my allergies. I'm sorry, my allergies are still messing with me. I'm going to pick up some Zyzol today, guys. I am picking up some Zyzol today. Um, but, um, guys, again, let's stop attacking and let's stop, let's start realizing that everyone is human and everybody makes mistakes. And that's the way I'm going to end it on this note. I'm not going to say nothing more. And I will catch you guys on a later video for PR. As always, stay beautiful. Stay blessed. I'm your girl, Samantha Sweets. I love y'all. Bye.